Tonight, the man who admitted to being drunk and shooting at police officers during a 12 hour standoff will now spend 20 years in prison. Seven Eyewitness News reporter Rachel Elzefan outside of court with the latest. Matthew Eck was sentenced to two 20 year prison terms, both to run concurrently. Judge D'Amico telling Eck, given his mental health history, he never should have had guns or alcohol in his house in the first place. An emotional morning in court as Matthew Eck learns his fate for shooting at two Erie County Sheriff's deputies during a drunken 12 hour standoff in the town of Concord. Eck pleaded guilty to two counts of second degree murder. To my families, I feel I destroyed their lives. Most important, I apologize to the officers and their, and their families. Oh, it's I could have destroyed their lives. Ex attorney says his client is a good person and a father of three, but has a history of severe depression. You know, when you talk about somebody at sentencing, you talk about you know, their whole life should come into play. He had been suicidal before and even tried to call his psychologist the day before the standoff, but could not fit into the schedule. The defense attorney asked for the minimum 15 years behind bars, but the judge said Eck knew he had a history of mental illness and never should have had a gun or alcohol in the house. Even Eck's defense attorney says he should have known better. Judge D'Amico told Eck he knew too many law enforcement officers killed while responding to similar calls and that Eck's actions have lasting effects. Not only to their families, but to the whole department and to police officers. They are some of the most emotional cases to try. I mean, these guys put their lives on the line every single day and every single night. In Buffalo, Rachel Alzafon, 7 Eyewitness News.